At Waterfront Toronto, we know that the first and best way to revitalize the waterfront is to plan, build, and open the parks and public spaces. We're leading with public space, and that's what's attracting revitalization. That's what's attracting the private sector down to the waterfront. And by next year, this old surface parking lot on East Bayfront is going to be transformed into our latest creation, Canada's Sugar Beach. You know, we stand here, and East Bayfront's growing all around us. It's clear just how important a park like this will be to the community. We've got the new workers, the students, the residents of East Bayfront are moving in. They're going to be drawn to white Muskoka chairs at the water's edge. They're going to have the lakefront view. They're going to have the dynamic industry here. They're going to really enjoy it. Very pleased to be part of today's groundbreaking of Canada's Sugar Beach Park, the second urban beach on the waterfront. This new development will be instrumental in bringing the community to life. Parks and open spaces are a vital part of the overall prosperity envisioned by the residents and businesses of East Bayfront. By converting this parking lot into a park, the city is once again underlining its commitment to help transform Toronto's industrial past into a beautiful future. We celebrate the stimulative part of this, the employment of the workers, some of whom are here, and we wish them uh, great uh, success in transforming this space and bringing it to life uh, for all of us. Most especially though, I want to acknowledge uh, all of the work that's been done by Waterfront Toronto. So I uh, very much look forward to participating with all of you and celebrating this one more piece of progress, this one more step on behalf of the people. This is exactly what Torontonians want their waterfront to be, a place they can access with their families. Sugar Beach will join HTO Park and Sherburn Park as wonderful gathering places along the Water's Edge Promenade for visitors, for chorus employees, for George Brown students and staff, as well as Torontonians and visitors who simply love their waterfront. We're very excited uh, uh, that we're beginning uh, uh, to put the shovel into the ground, but we're looking forward uh, uh, to seeing it completed. This will become an entry place, a place where people will live, where people will work, but also um, where people will draw together. Really, it will be an opportunity, this space, uh, for people to meet one another.